do you think you know, players mature faster than others? Is it because it helped that he had you know, playing experience last year? Even though Donovan was, was hurt and, and kind of missed a lot of the games, you know, is it, do people come? Do you think like come preordained with this gene that makes them no, you know, mature um, faster than others? No, I mean it's it's just experiences. Um, at least for me, I had to go through some stuff like uh, many injuries and stuff like that. And just situations throughout college that uh, makes you mature fast. You gotta it, it, it forms your brain. The coaching forms your brain and makes you mature. And, you know, that's all it is really. There's no. I don't think. I don't think there's any preordained mindset. If you have it, you have it. If not, it may take a little longer. To so. Last season being kind of a pass rush specialist. Have you seen that expand this the spring as far as? The role in the defense? Yeah, uh, I'm doing a lot more than just pass rushing, although that's my bread and butter. I'm doing everything else that uh, the team know that I've been doing since last year. Um, they're trying to get me on the field as much as possible. And, uh, yeah. Does that mean having more role in the run game, stopping the yeah. run game too? Uh, they want, I'm rotating in at defensive end during practice and stuff like that. Um, I'm at Sam now, and uh, just whenever they need me in there, uh, they're going to put me in there. So, yeah. Have you seen Aiden's game? Take the next step. He looks, he looks physically big. Yeah, he's, he's about 10 pounds, but and how, have you, how have you seen that added weight help his game? He's physical and he's fast. He hasn't lost a step since he's uh, adding on that weight. Um, and he's mental, like I was talking about before. Mentally, he's he stepped up. He feels like he's that guy. You know, I, I've seen him grow uh, going from last year to this year. He steps on the field. Everything, he's locked in. There's no errors. There's no, like, rookie mistakes or anything like that. He's locked in. So. He says you guys are using some motivation, saying, I don't know. I haven't read the scene, the stories, but he says he's read that, you know, people are put, putting this group down, comparing you yeah, to um, Rashawn and what you had here last year. I mean, what are, what are sort of, you're using that as motivation so you can be that be that group and better? I feel like our motivation is just uh, holding each other accountable and depending on each other. We don't want to let the guy next to us down. And that's what we use. And we know that we're looked down upon as a group to, to, to uh, out of the whole defense to not do as well. That's okay because um, that's for us to prove to the world wrong. So. And the transition to, from Madison to Nua, I mean, he, he mentioned that he's more hands-on, younger, six, a younger approach, one-on-one. -on -one. What's that What's that been like? Um, coach Nua's a great coach. I, I, really, I really love him. You know, he knows how to get through the guys, really be intricate with everything. And he knows how to sit there and break everything down and make sure you understand the fundamentals of everything. Like very detailed, very hands-on, and very caring guys. A, a lot, all the guys responded extremely well to him. So.